Well, the man accused of tragically killing three Girl Scouts and a mom in a hit and run last year is expected to change his plea. Our own Katrina Lim was at Colton True's motion hearing this morning in Chippewa County Court and brings us the latest. Katrina. As you know, True pleaded not guilty to all 10 felony charges against him, including four counts of homicide by intoxicated use of a vehicle. Prosecutors say he was huffing aerosol fumes when his truck went off the road and hit the Girl Scout troop as they picked up roadside litter last year. Three girls and a mother died. Another Girl Scout was hurt. Police say True then drove home and went to a party. True's team had requested a bench trial after claiming the court could not find an impartial jury because of extensive media coverage. However, the state objected to a bench trial and Judge James Isaacson ruled against the motion. Following that ruling, True's attorneys told the court their client is considering changing his plea. I'm going to make sure he has a full understanding of what he's in, entering into. Um, it has time between now and then to think about this and have questions presented to counsel. True's attorney tells News 18 they expect True will change his plea to some of the charges but did not disclose which ones. True's attorney said her client is also open to a plea deal. Now, True's change of plea will be addressed at the next motion hearing that's scheduled for December 16th. At this time, a jury trial is still on the calendar to begin January 21st.